What's up, carpoolers? Corduroy Paco's mobile vlogging unit is back, and we are filled with effect. Here it is. Well, it's Labor Day, the end. It's over. It's behind us. It's in the rear view mirrors, never to happen again. Summer 1 1 in the books. I gotta say, this summer went by in the blink of a hazel eye. I'm trying to do a wheezy waiter thing. Wheezy waiter, you know, ding, you know that stuff. Summer always seems to go by pretty fast, but this summer was like, you know, 1.21 gigawatts worth of fast. I remember when I was a kid, you'd be in like end of summer denial. Man, so middle of July, tons of summer, tons of summer. What, August 1st? Psh, that's a month, that's a whole month of summer. Are you kidding me? That's amazing, I have so much summer left. Then as August starts to wind down, you start seeing more and more back to school commercials on TV. You're like, what is this doing on? How can they talk about school already? It's only like August 28th. I can't even believe it. They're talking about school. There's so much summer left. Summer was wrapped up, but you're just like, nope, nope. Still a lot of summer, a lot of summer. By the end of August, you've watched every movie you had, you've rented every movie you could possibly rent. Back in those days, you had to rent movies. And just like languishing around, waiting for something to do. Those super long, hot August days were just like, let's, let's get this over with. But then the thing is, deep down, within me at least, I don't know how other school children were, <laughs> there's this weird thing of looking forward to going back, even though you knew it was a trap. Waiting for recess, can't wait for that lunch hour. Playing hockey with a tennis ball, but you can't have hockey sticks, you're playing with your feet, so essentially it's soccer with a tennis ball. We still called it hockey for some reason, you know, being Canadian, everything, it's hockey. And then you get back into school and it was just like, oh yeah, I remember this. Take out my math, yeah, okay, math book. I didn't miss that at all. And you're always reminded of it later, like, oh, summer was wicked. I remember that cannonball contest, I came in fourth. Like, those were the days. But I hope you had a good summer, carpoolers. I hope it lived up to all your expectations. I hope you're not bummed out it's over. And I hope you're looking forward to the fall season, which is my favorite season. I love fall, live for it, my favorite time. To me, it always works out something always big happens in November. I don't know why that happens, but it does. It's something I forget about until something big happens in November, and then I'm like, oh yeah, something always big happens in November. This will be the year nothing happens, because now I've got like, I don't know, like eight people watching this. I know I don't have a lot of viewers. I understand that. Stick with it, is what I say. Love the game. Or something. Even if you lose. Corduroy Paco, sad face. Regardless, carpoolers, thank you for sticking around with me all summer. I know I missed a couple vlogs. I will not do that again. Happy Labor Day. Happy upcoming fall. And remember, check your mirrors.